Hi, I'm Mars, co-founder of Polonize, and today I wanted to introduce you to a smarter and faster way to build and train great teams. Now, Polonize is a job simulation engine that takes a job description or even training material and instantly turns that into a tailored gamified simulation. Now, this allows your employees or even candidates to actively test and develop their skills in real world job scenarios, which means you get to see how someone performs in a relevant situation before making any critical decisions. And the gamified structure increases engagement, making the entire process smoother, more enjoyable, and a lot more effective. So let me take you through the platform so you can see how it works in practice. Okay, so what you're looking at here is the Polonize home screen, and each one of these squares represents what we call a campaign. Now a campaign is either a training campaign or an actual hiring campaign. So for instance, this is a campaign which is hiring Web3 software engineers. We have one here that we use ourselves to hire our sales partners. This one's a hiring campaign that Zoho used to hire some partners. But what I wanted to show you through to give you an idea of the entire process is this one here called Remote Software Engineers. So what you're seeing here is a series of games that simulates what it's like to be a remote software engineer for a large tech company like Meta. Each one of these games represents a particular scenario and each one of those scenarios is mapped to a particular skill set. So this one's remote communication, emotional intelligence, problem solving, adaptability. So if we go into one of these games, this one in particular is about dealing with your manager. And it's training the skill set of emotional intelligence. Now, if we go into that skill set of emotional intelligence, we can see that's made up of sub skills like empathy, awareness, openness, harmonization, passion, and transparency. These are customized skill sets that we have on our platform, but these can be totally customized for your particular scenario and situation and job role. So now we're going to go through a game so I can show you how one of these games plays out. I'll hit play here. So the first thing you do is select an AI opponent. And this brings us into what we call the game arena. The first thing you see is a particular scenario for this game. So this game is all about you are a software engineer working remotely as a part of a global team in a tech company. You work with colleagues and managers from many different countries. You work independently, but also collaborate using messaging and video calls. So very setting the scene of a remote software engineer. You've just given a team update where you're told that your code module is running behind schedule and you'll miss a deadline. The manager calls you personally after the meeting and he's unhappy with your delay. He tells you that he would like you to work on the weekend to make up and finish by Monday morning. You have family commitments on the weekend, including a visit from your parents. The Monday deadline is unrealistic and you feel that you can only complete the module by Tuesday afternoon at the earliest. So that's the scenario. It's a very realistic scenario. And now as the player, I have to answer this challenge. How do you manage your unhappy manager who wants you to work on the weekend? So this is where, as a player, I do the bulk of my work. At the moment, it's text only, but we'll be bringing on audio and video very soon. So here, you're able to spend a bit of time, five to 10 minutes, really crafting your response. Usually, you can't cut and paste, but for the sake of demo purposes, I can as an admin. So I'll paste in my response there. I'll put a heading in here, and I'm ready to deploy my response. Okay, so now what happens is my opponent, it's my opponent's turn to respond. So this is my opponent's response. And there's two things to, to note at this particular point in time. We have Gen AI in the background, which generates responses, but also you can input a benchmark response, which means that you can really set the standard for how you want this particular challenge to be answered. And then what you'll see now is our analyzer AI comes in to analyze those responses according to the skill set. And this plays out kind of like a Street Fighter game. You have the scores down here at the bottom. And what the AI is doing is going through and analyzing each one of those sub skills out of 12 to see who's done better overall. That's not too bad. 68 to good score. 68 to 53. So I won. I won some in game currency, which now. I can use to unlock some rewards, which I'll show you in a moment. The great thing to note here is that there's a lot of learning within this process. I can look at one of my skill sets and, and see how I scored and get feedback from our AI. So you can see you can get quite nuanced with this and very specific in the way you use this to develop team skills. Now, the next thing I want to show you is that when you come out of this game, you get what's called a PIQ. 
And this is out of 100, so you're measured against the response, 100 being a benchmark, being average. And so you can see here that I beat the opponent by a certain amount, 128.3 as a PIQ within emotional intelligence within this particular work scenario, which makes this a very powerful tool to really measure and train people in very specific skills within your business. So now the beauty of this is I can come back out of that game, go back to the campaign and click on talent here. And now this is where some of the higher order game dynamics really start to come in. Now we can see a leaderboard of the top players that have played through this game. And we can see this certified sign here, which means that these top six players here have played all the games and have beat the benchmark in all those games. You can see they've got quite good PIQs. And if we click in, we can see this, this particular play here is an MVP. has got a higher than 130 PIQ, which is quite good. 100% win ratio. There's a whole lot of data that comes into this that makes us able to dive in and have a look at how this particular individual performed over the game set. Gives us a depth of, a depth of data. We can analyze the particular response to see how they went about answering each one of the challenges, which gives you a very deep contextual understanding of a person's skill and ability. Then what happens is those that have been certified can come over to, here to the reward tab. They can unlock a job interview directly with whoever's taking the job interview. In this case, it's with our CEO, which means that especially in the hiring process, this gives total autonomy to the individual themselves. As a business looking for talent, you're able to really set a benchmark of what you want to achieve, what standard you want your candidates to be at. And then as soon as they exceed that standard, they're able to come in, book an, an interview directly with you or someone in your hiring department, which expedites that process, makes it super quick, super fast, and you're only getting quality candidates through the system without looking at a resume or dealing with recruiters, which is the best part of it. So there you have it, a brief overview of Polonize and what it can do. You probably have some questions. I've left a meeting link in the email. If you click that through, you can book in a meeting with me and we can really look into how Polonize can specifically help your business in either training or hiring. I look forward to it. Chat then.